All right, it's time to play some Resident Evil Zero. This is the supposed Resident Evil game that starts everything. And yes, I'm gonna choose easy on this one because I'm pressed for time, and if you don't like it, too bad. Resident Evil Zero. Anyways, let's, uh, let's get started. Oh yeah, that's one thing I'll mention is that uh, the new controls, I think back in my other Resident Evil stream that I mentioned this, but I'll just refresh everyone's memory, that uh, the controls I think this time around with the alternate scheme are much better. Anyways, everything looks fine. Here we go. A Midwestern town in America, Raccoon City, a solitary island far off in the sea, Rockfort Island, an island that would become the second Raccoon City, Sheena Island. There are still many unanswered questions about these seemingly unrelated yet intensely traumatic events. Though it is believed that the International Enterprise umbrella was somehow involved, Little is known as to the origin of this faceless corporation. When was it established? By whom? And how was the T-Virus created? To uncover the truth, we must delve deeper into the events. One thing I like is who's narrating this? The beginning, before the mansion incident. So too. Yeah. Do about it. Hold up for a while. I wonder how those dark people react to this. Oh, that's nice. I just want to stop and say hello. Well, I guess these folks aren't going to get their uh, refund for uh, yeah, their uh, train ride uh, being delayed. of some bizarre murders in the suburbs of Raccoon City. Nothing in our training could ever have prepared us for the nightmare that ensued. We never stood a chance. What's going on? Engine failure. Emergency landing. position and investigate the surrounding area. Captain, look! <gasps> Captain! Hmm? What happened? Order for transportation. Prisoner Billy Cullen, ex lieutenant, 26 years old. Court martialed and sentenced to death July 22nd. Prisoner is to be transferred to the Ragathon base for execution. Those poor soldiers. They were good men just doing their jobs, and that scum murdered them and escaped. All right, everyone, let's separate and survey the area. Our friend is brutal and ruthless. Keep your guard up.
door to safety is shut. There is no turning back. Ironic that you would think that going inside would be safe, but <laughs> not this time. And we get to play as our uh, little friend here, Rebecca. Which you may recall that she was in the first game also. The door to the dining car is locked. Okay, I'm going to need a key. Oh yeah, as I mentioned before, uh, the control scheme. Like I said before in my other, uh, yeah, my other stream of Resident Evil, I think the alternate scheme is way better. Hang on a minute here, something isn't right. This is Officer Chambers from Stars Bravo. Wait till this is finished. Please identify yourself. Is someone there? The government has announced that Oh, this is nice. That's our map. Messenger luggage is scattered all over the place. Ah, get away from me! Oh, get away! Ah. I told you to equip your weapon, young lady. Sometimes it is better to run and rather than waste ammo. So now we're in the other car. I don't have to take a moment here to it. A... Okay, so it's right bumper. I thought it was right trigger. Nope. Okay, you zombie dudes. Let's try this again here. This time I'm not going to get bit. It's been a while since I've played Resident Evil Zero. So you're just gonna have to bear with me. Whew, that takes care of that problem. Alright, so the first thing first is I have to get a dining car key. The rain outside is quickly turning into a downpour. And soon we're all gonna be submerged. So we're going to turn this train into a submarine. I like that nice. There doesn't seem to be anything of use. I'll take the handgun ammo for sure. Oh, there's a diary. July 14th. Orders came from the boss today. Looks like we're in charge of investigating the remains of the Arclay Mountains Laboratory. We're moving in two groups. The initial group is assigned to start checking what's left of the abandoned experiment. July 16th. Unfortunately, the test production of BOW type Y139 had to be suspended because of this investigation. Bummer. It's the same with type Y139. Wait, didn't we already mention that? Anywho, there's still so much we don't know about response to the crustacean T-virus. There's a lot of interesting research left. Well, I bet there is. Depending on the species and nurtur nurturing conditions, only minute doses of tea bring about remarkable changes in solidity, size, multiplication of internal toxins, and brain development. If these effects can be controlled, a powerful weapon could be produced. More on that later. But the sudden development of the shell results in a corresponding fragility. Certain areas become exceedingly weak. Problematically, one of these areas is the head carapace. I think this is vital for something that's going to come up later. This lab we are going to... Were they pursuing the same research? It could certainly help to find data and samples that would help us in our research. June 19th. The day is finally approaching. I am growing more anxious. The Raccoon City newspapers and TV stations are full of reports about the bizarre murders of the suburbs. It can't be the virus, can it? If it is... No. I can't think of that now. I have to concentrate on this investigation and make sure it goes smoothly. So 
So basically, I think so basically I think this is giving me a little bit of a hint about what's to come. Anyways, let's get out of here. I'm gonna take the ink ribbon. Is there anything else in this train? I don't believe there is. All right. Herbs. And more handgun ammo. Investigation orders. Stained with blood, some sections are, are ill-eligible. Eight miles north of Raccoon City, in the Arclay Mountains, lies our company's management training facility. It was shut down years, ag years ago. Now we are conducting a preliminary study into the reopening of the facilities. First investigation unit is already on site and opening the investigation. I want your team to provide support. The following orders are William Burke and First Ice. Okay, it's starting to become a little less legible. First investigation unit, there we go. The rest is torn and unreadable. Hmm. That kind of that sucks. Let's see if there's anything else that'd be used around here? Besides the typewriter? I don't think there is. Let's just go ahead and get started with the saving. Alright, so we're inside the cabin. And just like in my other Resident Evil stream, make sure you use your ink ribbons wisely. Okay, it's locked and can't be opened. The door reads conductor's office. Okay, so we're gonna need two keys. This train employee's corpse has been brutally torn apart. He's holding something. Take the train key. Hey, you okay? Mister? Mister? Huh? Billy. Lieutenant Cohen. So, you seem to know me. Been fantasizing about me, have you? You're the prisoner that was being transferred for execution. You were with those soldiers outside. Oh, I see. You're with stars. Well, no offense, honey, but your kind doesn't seem to want me around. So, I'm afraid our little chat time is over. Wait! You're under arrest! No thanks, Dollface. I've already worn handcuffs. I could shoot, you know. I just choose not to. Edward! Are you alright? What happened? Worse than... We can't... You must be careful, Rebecca. Full of zombies and monsters. Zombies and monsters. Uh, uh. Ah! Um, nice doggy. Good doggy. Um, please don't eat me. Just a rope, a rope egg kicks or something. Ow. He is doing flip kicks. You know that's pretty impressive. I gotta admit. Oh. Hey, stop doing those kicks, bad doggy. How's she doing? I'm gonna 
too concerned yet. Oh, I want to take a look at that key. The tag reads dining car. Okay, so there's the key for the dining car. Perfect. You see a broken ladder. It's of no use right now. Alright, so I gotta go back to the dining car. And I don't think I can go upstairs yet. This is Rebecca. Over. Use the dining car key. Yeah, throw the key away. It's gonna be dangerous from here on in. Why don't we cooperate? Cooperate with you? Listen, little girl, if you haven't noticed, there's some pretty freaked out things on this train. And I, for one, want to get out of here. I don't think we stand a chance doing it alone. You expect me to trust you, a wanted felon? I don't need your help. I can handle this on my own. And don't call me little girl. All right, miss do-it-yourself. What should I call you? The name is Rebecca Chambers, but that's Officer Chambers to you. Well then, Rebecca... Why don't you go and try while I wait here? I take back everything I said about him being a nice guy. He's a jerk. Notice to supervisors. When closing the dining car, supervisor asked to switch off the automatic doors after ensuring all staff have vacated the car. The main automatic door power switch is located on the roof of the fifth car. Inspections will take place when the train is garaged. After inspections are complete, use the ladder at the rear of the second floor of the dining car. Alright, so that's our next clue. Looks like an automatic door. There's no. Okay, so that's our next step. We gotta get the power back on. Sir? Sir? Are you dining alone? Oh! <gasps> oh, that's lovely.
They're probably thinking she wasn't that edible anyways. Okay. engine car listen we've got to cooperate with each other from now on you got that who died and put you in charge well i don't clue in girl or maybe you like being worm bait all right but you just remember i will shoot you if you try anything funny fine now take these with you if you find anything give me a call all right I got a choice in the matter. Now, this is the mechanic here that people had mixed feelings about. You can switch control between the two lead characters, Rebecca and Billy, and use their different abilities to progress throughout the game. The control you currently controls the main character. The control. Yeah, we get that. Okay. So basically, the partner character generally moves independently, but you can use the right controls to control them yourself. Which. Can be handy. Selecting partner on the status screen allows you to assign instructions to the character. Solo and team. Both characters move independently, and team partner follows the main character. Attack, idle. Alright. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that's. Yeah, like I said before, a lot of people had a bit of mixed feelings about this uh, mechanic. About having to control two characters. Which, on one side, you would think that, yeah, having another character means you can carry more things. But on the other hand, you have to play babysitter to them. Anywho, when you're nearby, when your partner is... Bleh. Let me try that again. When your partner character is nearby, you can exchange items on the status screen. Choose the item from the main character's item box and select exchange. Okay, so this is what Rebecca can do. She can combine herb items, use... A mixing tech to combine chemicals, which is going to be necessary later, but can't take as many hits. Billy, on the other hand, he has he's more powerful and can push many large objects. How cliche. If the partner character is attacked, both the main and partner character will die if they take too much damage. You should always keep an eye on their condition. Like I said before, more babysitting, because I don't think they'll heal themselves. A partner being attacked in a different room will call for help over the radio. If a partner does call, go to help as quickly as possible. And cooperating with your partner. Some puzzles cannot be solved by only one character. When you are stuck, try to see if using your partner will help. Oh, boy. Alright, so let's see what old Billy's got here. Yeah, he has a knife. He's got a lighter. It's locked from the other side. Alright, so let's take Billy for a spin. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. There's a ladder here. It seems to lead up to the roof. I'm up the ladder. Yes. Okay, there's some wiring here. Let's take a look. The power cable has been disconnected. Reconnect the cables. Ah. Oh, that's real nice. Dumbwaiter, which is extremely handy. Take 
Tranky. Alright. Service lift is stopped off the first floor. Call the service lift. Not yet. Let's see if this does anything. There's something stuck in the keyhole. It's preventing the doorknob from turning. You could probably... Okay, so yeah, we're gonna need another item later. So at this point, I'll have to change back to Rebecca. I can't reach it from up here. Because I don't think she can, uh... Yeah, I think she can, I think she stops. What did that say? The counter is laden with various types of food. There doesn't seem to be anything of use. Shelf is full of cooking utensils. It doesn't seem to be of anything in use. There's an access panel here. You need some kind of tool. Okay, so that's another thing we're gonna need. Locked from the other side. All right. Okay, so this is where basically we're gonna start playing. Uh. No. All right, so. So basically what I'm going to have to do is give her the herbs so she can combine the herbs together. Something written on the tag. Conductor's room. Okay, so I have to give that to Rebecca along with the herbs. He can keep the first aid spray though. Yeah, call it up. And this is where we get to see the... Uh, Exchange item come into play. Yes. Give it the key. Pretty full. All right. Um. All right. So what I'm gonna have to do is use the conductor's key first, and I'm gonna have to come back and get the herb. Excuse you. I'm gonna head upstairs and see if there's anything of use. style phone. The line has been cut, rendering it useless. Oh, not yet. We'll come back later in just a minute. After I get rid of the uh, conductor's key. Please stay in your seat, sir, while the train's in motion. Others, I'll have to shoot you.
Yeah, I can only imagine that, hearing saying that from an actual uh, train worker employee. Oh, wait, I gotta go in here to save. He's making a little bit of leeway. Alright. So I got my partner. Yes, alright, save data. Just a few hours ago, he's holding something. Rest in peace, dude. Use the conductor's key. You don't need to see me this key anymore, so bye bye. Oh, what's this? A map. Cool. Took the train map. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think we got everything we need here. Oh, that's a nice red button. There's a switch here, flip it. Perfect. Briefcase. Let's take a look. Note from conductor. The key card for the driver's compartment is in my bag as always, but I need the other guy's key too to open the thing. But it looks like I've lost it somewhere. If it was a normal key, someone would shoot, be sure to turn it, but this key is different. I'll look for it too, but if you happen to find it, please hand it in. Thanks in advance. Anonymous. Sure. Whatever. Alright, so, let's take a look at my situation here. He's got one thing open. It appears to me like there are two holes that look as if they fit some... Okay, so that's our next objective, is we gotta find two, uh, objects. Of course, I'm gonna exchange this with Billy. I need to have a space open. My inventory is pretty full right now. That's what I want to do. Is give him the briefcase and he'll give me the herb and I'll combine those herbs together. Like I said, he can keep the first day spray. give him the first ace spray. In exchange, he'll give me the herb. Because he's going to need it for later. So it kind of makes you wonder what Billy's been doing the whole time. Uh, I'm just sitting there twiddling his thumbs. Oh yeah, there's that third herb. Also...
I don't need to do that. What was I thinking? Yeah, the third over was on the other set of stairs. since we're up here anyways. They look like some kind of eggs. A puddle of slime has formed around them. Ew. And I know there's more, but we can't get anywhere right now. Alright, so, back this way. but uh does he have any more room in his inventory hmm well one thing I could do is well, one thing I could do actually is uh I'm just trying to think what I can do at this point give it one sec here um I think everything seems to be fine here. Okay, as I was saying here, um... Hmm. What do I want to do? Hmm. Well, one thing I could do is give him the mixed herbs, and that'll give me room for the green herb, and I can combine those items together. Yeah, but then he'll... Well, he's gonna need it. That's just it. Because I know there is a boss fight coming up later. Um, what to do, what to do. So many choices. Yeah, you see, this is what I was getting at when I said, uh, people had mixed feelings about this mechanic. together, which will give me the exact same properties as the, uh, of the three green herbs. Anyways, I got what I want.
There we go. This is what I wanted. Let's take a look. A compound created by combining a green herb with a red herb. And I think there are six combinations, if I remember correctly, and I think this is only two. bar lounge. Glasses and bottles are scattered all over the counter. situation first. Um, I'm going to have to leave everything behind for now. Except maybe take this. What is this? Okay, that's the ice pick. I definitely need to take that back to Billy. He needs that. Definitely something going on. Hello. Uh. Hey, how's it going? How's it going, dude? Sets the position. Because I know, I think she can kill the giant scorpion. Uh, nice scorpion. Please go away. Please don't hurt me. Ow! Ow! I just love that. That is just so funny. Okay, she is definitely hurt. I think she should be alright. Yeah, he did. Oh, thank god that's over. Yeah, just for safety's sake, I, I think she better take this. Alright, she feels fine now. Oh, definitely gonna need that for sure. Does it gave me a hole in the ceiling? No. Is there really? Alright.
that takes care of that. Put it inside. Uh, no. Got a better idea. Let's see here. I'll give her the first aid, one of the first aid sprays. There's an item here. That's gonna do it. Now we can get Billy out of here. And that is where the ice pick comes into play. On one of the strangest use of a uh, lock pick, but we're out. to be out of fuel. Okay, so that's another vital clue. The thing that we need to know about Billy is that he can burn the zombies. Once you find a fuel, that is. A half-eaten meal sits on the table. Not very appealing. Anyways, let's go find Rebecca. Since I am here, let's take a look at their inventories. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, I think we're just fine. Oh, I got my partner back. Let's go save. partner. Actually, yeah, I do have to go back, regardless. Uh, behind you!
save it. I missed, but now that I got my partner back, let's go get him. Okay, here we go. This is what I want. Okay. Give him one of the green herbs and I'll keep the other two for myself. Don't need to use it. later. Once I get a little more free space, that is. Oh, look. More items. I know some of these items we're going to have to leave behind. Oh, no, wait a minute. I got another idea. Wait a minute. Give me an idea. See if this will work. See if I can combine items like this, like a so. Welcome to the Ecliptic Salon. Please join us for a moment of relaxation. Oh, I bet. what I want. Hang on to this herb for later. Oh man, more of these things. Ew. Although I wonder if... Yeah, I think that blocks the other way, I believe. Alright, so... There's a shotgun here. The ink ribbon? Sure. Why not? Like, we Alright, so what we're gonna need to do is we're gonna exchange ammo. Okay, because there's a shotgun here, and I need one of them to carry it. Oh jeez, I need two blocks here. Okay, um Well. Do. I mean, can I necessarily waste the herb on this? I mean, for starters here, Billy does not need the knife. I'm gonna leave the knife behind. I guess... I guess I could give him the green herb. That'll free up room for the shotgun, because we're going to need that for sure. And I guess I could leave my handgun behind. I guess. Because I need room for the shotgun ammo. Oh, over there. Over there. Over there. Over there. No, 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 no. Over there. There you go. Shotgun ammo as well. Hmm. 
Although, if I remember correctly, items that you don't acquire in the train actually appear at the end. I believe. I'm not sure. Alright. Let's get out of here. So our next step is the panel. Ooh, there he goes, down. All right, enter the crawl space. Because I think only she can fit, if I'm not mistaken. I think Billy's a little too big. Shotgun ammo. Alright. And there's the item for Billy. Really? The exact item I need I can't carry. Well, I suppose we have to waste an herb. But there'll be plenty more. It's just one herb, not that big of a deal. Take the gas tank. Alright. Well, actually, let's examine this first. It's filled with gasoline. Oh, yeah, that's right. You pour it on the corpses and watch them burn. Oh, that's one of the items I need. It's alright, we'll just drop the gas canisters. One. Perfect. Alright, cool. That takes care of one. Oh, yeah. The door is now unlocked. Groovy. Let's see what the other side has to offer. End of the line. No chest attached to the wall to use a permanent weapon release lock. Okay, so that's another thing to take into consideration for later. Frankly, we'll need a magnetic card operator. Okay, so that's our next objective is to find the card. Hello. Okay, I think that's what's needed to make a Molotov cocktail. Alright. 
take a look at my map here for a minute. Okay, so we'll need the grappling hook. I believe we're here. Alright, so there's no way to get inside there. Let's just save it here anyways, since we made a little more progress. in here besides the uh, leftover items? I don't believe there was. Well, he could carry one more item. Oh, we're gonna take the first aid spray.
notice anything else per se in uh, this room? I don't believe so. This poor guy must have been attacked in his sleep. His body is covered in slime. Poor dude. Finally, Taylor said that's nothing in the pockets. What do you expect to score a uh, $50 tip or something? Yeah, so you can forget it. So the nice thing to do is to get that other circle. The problem is I don't remember where it is. It could be anywhere. I gotta find one more of those uh, things. Like I said, there's one more. But where is it? Doubt it's through here. Um, <laughs> did I miss anything in here, per se? in here. I don't know if I'm supposed to shoot these or not. No. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think uh, I'm supposed to shoot these guys. Yeah, there's just too many of them. Hmm. 
figure out what to do next. Hmm. So I know I need the grappling hook for sure. We also need the magnetic key card. there now and uh, reconnect everything. That's a possibility. this. It's a release lever. Oh, I didn't see that coming. Oh, I 
should have known. Oh well. Well. I hate to wait. I'd have to hate to waste two perfectly good items. But there's still gonna be plenty more later. So I need room for the grappling hook. Should have thought of this sooner. Oh well. Look shot operator's manual. Warning. This device you only use when inspecting difficult to access cars or when connecting special trains. Return to its proper location after use. Where to use? There's a ladder outside the small window. Yeah, 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 we already know about this. Find a device so that it hooks high into the ladder. Use the winch to climb up to secure another. Use the winch to lift yourself up. This craft will only lift one person at a time. Beware, you can be damaged lifting more than 80 kilograms, so Rebecca's gonna have to use it. Uh oh. Oh, I see. Come on. Okay. Oh yeah, there's another first aid spray right there. Duh. I left it there. She's lighter. So that's where the grappling hook comes in. I guess Billy can use it because, uh, reasons. Hey, how's it going? I didn't see you there. Uh, sorry, mate, but, uh... I'll take more ammo. Thank you very much. Oh, what do we have here? You cannot carry this item now. Oh, I wonder if my inventory's full. Yep. Oh, that's real nice. Ah, get off of me. Ah, get off. Get off of me, you little... Yeah, it's kind of funny that, uh, you can't just step on it. Oh, there we go. I oh, if I had known that, that would save me a little bit of ammo. Whee! Get off me, you little... That's okay, you just squishy, squishy them. Get off of me, you little...
It's about time you got up here. Alright, so... Well, let's go return that grappling hook back to its rightful place. Come on! Yeah. Now that we got the passageway cleared, and it took me that long to figure out. Now that we have access, we don't need the grappling hook anymore. Like I said, I got the upper passageway access, so no point in carrying this lug around anymore. But I will, however, take that first aid spray, though. Okay, so, where was I? Oh, yes! One item in particular. This jewelry box. Let's take a look. It looks like it's a case for only jewelry. You think? Oh my gosh, you can propose it! You can propose! Aww. Too bad. for that. You know, I can only imagine Rebecca and Billy as a couple. On second thought, never mind. Briefcast has been unlocked. Open it. Let's see what's inside. Ah. This key card is used to unlock the electronic door to the lead car. All right. Now we're making some progress here. I like it. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, there was one other room I was going to look at. Um, is it this one, per se? Um, oh, this is just that other room. All this stuff we really don't need at this point. But we'll come back for it. So let's. Let's get out of here. So now we gotta go to the lead car. I think, I think we're going backwards, if I'm not mistaken. Am I going back? No, I'm actually going the right way. Perfect. Okay, I thought I was going backwards, but I guess not. I can't believe it took me that long to figure out the, uh... Switch was right there the whole time. Oh, well. That's why 
And we have this. What? Oh, unless it's on for the other side. There's a card reader here. It looks like the door will open if you have the right card. And I do. The door is now unlocked. Yep. All right, let's go inside. This is Delta Team. This is Delta Team. We have gained control of the train. Over. Understood. This does oh, not we all know who that is. How was the T-Virus leaked? And why did it contaminate both the lab and the mansion, as well as a train almost three miles away? That's irrelevant. We must make sure no knowledge of this gets out. Destroy the train. Completely. How far away are you from the nearest branch line? About ten minutes to... Huh? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> I'll tell you what happened. You lost two good men. All right. The train is quickly picking up speed. The engine chamber is badly damaged. There's no way to fix it. Oh boy, this is gonna be good. I probably should have saved before doing this. But I guess this isn't too difficult to figure out. The train line, the derailer crash. I gotta stop this thing. Okay, you go ahead and try to stop this thing. I'll just sit here and uh, idolize about something else. Brake operation manual. Using the brake control, the following three steps are necessary to operate the brakes. Step one, activating the controls. Brake controls are located in the following locations. First car driver's compartment, rear deck of the fifth car. De Wait. How come only reveals two? Well, anyways. To activate the system, you must insert the magnetic card into the device in the fifth card. This will supply power to both sets of controls. Step two, enter the enter rear deck code. Enter the code for the rear deck unit to release lock. After this, the driver's compartment code can be entered. Step three, enter driver's compartment code. Enter the code for the driver's compartment unit to remove the lock. Upon completion of these three steps, the manual brakes can be used. Who will stay behind? We're gonna leave Billy because she has the ink ribbon. I'll go over to the back deck and manipulate the control panel for the brake. You stay here and apply the brake when ready. Okay. Rebecca. Huh? Don't screw up, okay? Oh, I like won't. I need oh like I need confidence from you. I'm fully capable of handling myself. Thank you very much. I don't have room for the herbs. I will, however, take the hand ammo. Okay, let's take a look at this magnetic card real quick. Okay. on the brakes, so we're going to have to go all the way back. Like I said, I did this once before on my first try. And this is going to be costly. I still got plenty of shotgun ammo, so I'm not too concerned. Oh, yeah. Adios. Uh, 
And like I said, it's a mad dash all the way to the back. Uh oh. Edward! Edward! No! Stop! Don't come any closer! You mean to do? Sorry to do this, Edward. You gave me no choice. Okay, we're here. Now it's time to put that card in. Which I am. So. What? There it goes. Alright. Now I know there's a very specific. So it's gotta be 81. You can use this to operate the brake. Okay, so it has to add up exactly to 81. Um, let's see here. Got it. This is Rebecca. I have engaged the control device for the brake. Over. Roger. I'll put the brake on now. Okay, his is a little bit trickier because now it's got to go up to 67, so. 9, 18, 27. 36, um, let's see here, 44, 52, 57, 61, 64, 67, perfect. Oh yeah, that wasn't so hard. Whew, plenty of time to spare too. Nice job, partner. And I think if I remember correctly, like I said, I think there are still items scattered about. Oop, we're not going that way. Let's take a look at the map. Oh yeah. Like I said, there's still items here from the train. Oh, look. Alright, so let's take a look at our inventory situation here. Oh sh oh she's out of shotgun ammo. Um well, play it safe for Rebecca. She can have her handgun back. She better get the handgun. For the time being. Alright.
All right, made it. Let's see here. Danger, authorized personnel only. Climb up the ladder. in there. Shoot. Oh, well. I guess it's... The Umbrella Research Center? <gasps> the first general manager, Dr. James Marcus. Who on earth are those people? She's just a rookie, a member of STARS. Hmm, what about the male? I'm unfamiliar with Attention! Him. This is Dr. Marcus. Please be silent as we reflect upon our company motto. Obedience breeds discipline. Discipline breeds unity. Unity breeds power. Power is life. <laughs> Who are you? It was I who scattered the T-Virus in the mansion. Needless to say, I contaminated the train, too. What? Revenge. On Umbrella. Dr. Marcus was murdered by Umbrella. You helped them, didn't you? <laughs> well, that was very interesting, to say the least. here. Alright, so let's take a look at our inventory situation again. Well. Get a little closer here. Some herbs. And I'll take about half the ammo back. Thank you very much. Yeah, this will suffice. a puzzle to draw the swords up. Oh, look, more herbs. Well, leave them. Don't need them right now. Well, what's this sign say? Oh, it doesn't say anything of use. Hmm, 
Okay, there's more stuff here, but we're gonna have to leave it because I don't have inventory space. Yeah. And to bet you can't stole items away. Hello. Oh, dude. Dang. Here, we'll just exchange. I'll give you the ink ribbon for a first aid spray. Oh, yeah, that's much better. I guess I don't have enough. Oh, wait. Make more herbs this way. Because why not? Hey, Rebecca, do you mind getting these things off of me? Perfect. They're just squishy them. Just squishy squishies. Get back here, you little. There, got it. I have to do just squishy, squishy them. Not too difficult to figure out. engraved with the image of a clock. Okay, so that's a clue for later. Oh wait. Well, she's only got one shot at this, so. Oh no, wait, there was ammo right there the whole time. Doy. It is rusty. Not even a single drop of water comes out. Well, that's nice. The tree looks lonely and wiltered. It seems there is no one to take care of it. Uh, let's see. Or anything else of use laying around? Oh, more ammo. Goody. Uh, excuse you, Billy. Go that way. Good. It's locked. The door is in lost with a fire motif. Okay. Let's head this way. I don't want to go upstairs as of yet. Let me see what my options are first. What's this? It's another doorway. What's 
this? Okay, so that's one important item I'm going to need. No! Get off me, jerk! Oh, what do we have here? Hello. What do we have here? Not that. This. Okay, so I guess I'll have to drop the other shotgun in favor of this. Definitely taking this for sure. A conventional pump action shotgun. I like, I don't know how nice. Okay, so it's the uh, chemist set. Okay, cool. Um, I do need to carry that statue with me. So, once again, Billy, I'm placing you in charge of all the ammo. Perfect. I have to carry this. Stone statue with a single eerie looking wing on its back. Mm -hmm. And nothing of use. Okay. Let's move on. Oh, what do we have here? Climb up the ladder? Sure, why not? Good, more herbs. Okay, that's for later. Let's see what else we got. The door is now unlocked. I wasn't aware it was locked to begin with. But I came from the first floor up here, so there you go. Okay, so now where am I? Excuse me? Okay, so let's take a look at the map. Okay, this looks like a presentation room of some kind. Oh, there's a safe station on the other side as well. Alright, um, let's see here. Oh, no. Let's see what this has to say. Regulations for trainees. Training facility mansion. Or mission, excuse me. This training facility would raise a new generation of model employees to serve the future of Umbrella Corporation. Applying the strictest and most rigorous training standards, this facility will... Wait, is this a military base? Is this a military camp or is this a pharmaceutical company? Anyways, without regard for gender, race, or creed, can produce only the best candidates for, to be the future leader, global leaders of Umbrella Corporation. We look forward to the development of your leadership qualities. Oh, I bet. Training facility guidelines. Discipline, obedience, unity. Dewey. The three words are the basic principles which govern Umbrella Corporation employees and to be considered the law of this facility. Keep these words in mind at all times. Devote yourselves to your training and bring honor to you, to yourselves and the corporation. James Marcus, Director, Umbrella Corporation, Management Training Facility. Available in paper book for only $19.99. Whew. That's uh, quite a, that's quite a guideline book right there for your future employees. That figures. Well. Let's see here. Uh, Rebecca, excuse me? Take the ink ribbon? Sure. Take the handgun ammo? Why not? Um, okay, so. 
Well, I guess you can use up. Here, I'll exchange this. I'll take the statue. You can use one of the herbs. And she'll take the shotgun ammo. Perfect. Alright. Alright, let's... Let's save it here. Excuse me. Conference room. Alright. Alright. That worked out perfectly here. Um... All right, this is going to do it for right now. Um, thank you, everybody, for watching. I will see you all next time.